So this is the buzz box that I built. Uh, it's basically just a box that lets you play games like Jeopardy or Family Feud and just general trivia games. Uh, so the idea is basically you have a, a buzzer, which uh, you can unwrap here, and it's got a long cord from 6 to 12 feet, and uh, you plug your buzzer into one of the corresponding colors, and uh, you need at least a buzzer here for the uh, reset switch. And then let me just turn this on. Then a player can buzz in, and their light lights up, and then... The host who's reading the questions can reset the box. Uh, each each person who buzzes can only buzz if no other lights are lit. If that light is already lit and then somebody tries to buzz, it won't work. Uh, yeah, it's pretty simple. Uh, there doesn't there's no computer or anything involved here. It's just electronics. Uh, I've also got a little switch up here for some sound. You can turn the sound on or off. And uh, I'll just basically show you the box. It's basically made from, made the box out of a sheet of plywood uh, I picked up from the hardware store, and it's broken off into three different sections. So there's a little compartment here that you can put some trivia cards if you'd like. I just got a battery in there for now. And then uh, the whole, the box contains all the buzzers. That's why it's so big. If you look in here, there's, uh, I got 16 buzzers in there, or 17, I guess, with the reset switch as well. So that actually allows up to eight players here. Uh, well, I should say 16 players, eight teams. So there's only eight individual lights, but you can actually hook up two players per light to work together on a team. So uh, if you're in a, have a large party going on of like 10 people or so, everyone can uh, get in on this trivia. So uh, let me just show you the inside here. Just mounted on these like computer screws to seal it up. All right, so these are the electronics inside and basically what it is is uh, two, two of these game show circuit boards here which uh, you can buy as a kit online. They're about like 15 bucks each and uh, each one of these things allows uh, a button press to make the circuit go off. Oh, let me just turn that on. There you go. And then a reset button. So all these uh, all these ports here are basically just extended onto this board, uh, just so you can get your switch further away. And uh, of course, that's all the wiring for the LEDs up here. Uh, so I got some a couple boards at the back on the wall there and those are just the resistors that I've put on uh, for the top LEDs and then this is a little triple five timer circuit that I made uh, so that way the buzzer only buzzes for a second or two there when it comes on. Uh, yes yeah, so it's not too complex it's a bit of a mess but other than that it works pretty well you don't need didn't cost that much. Don't need an Andrino board like some people use. Uh, fairly straightforward. And uh, as you can see here, I've also compiled a database of trivia questions. So these are all just like Family Feud style questions or just general trivia questions and answers. Uh, just to go along with this whole binder full of them. So there's like 50,000 questions in there. That'll keep you busy for a while. And uh, yeah, if you want to see uh, if you want to see the database I put together or um, more information on this, just click some of the links in the description. Thanks for watching.